What's going on everybody? Nick from 618 Fishing here and welcome back to another fishing adventure. In today's episode, I'm going to attempt to complete a pretty big goal of mine, which is to catch a wild rainbow trout on my fly rod. Fast forward an hour and 45 minutes and we have finally made it to our fishing spot. Finally all rigged up. I've got my two fishing poles. Let's get down to the creek. Just made it down to the creek and I cannot get over how beautiful this place is. Such an awesome, awesome fishing location. The key for today is going to be stealth above all else. The casting is very important but it's not gonna matter if the fish already see me. Oh, you guys, I just had a strike. Oh my gosh, you guys, I just caught a fish. It looks like a tiny little bait fish. I'm not sure what this is. See you later, buddy. I have no idea what that fish was, but it's certainly not what I'm after. I'm still in search of my first wild trout on the fly rod. Guys, I think there are some right here in this pool. They're either trout or creek chubs. There we go, fish on. Oh my gosh, it's a giant creek chub. Holy smokes. See you later, buddy. I just caught a new personal best creek chub, but that is not what I'm after today. So I'm gonna keep searching. Oh my gosh, you guys, I just caught a tiny fish. And it's gone. I'm thinking I'm gonna have to start working my way a little bit closer to where the spring actually is because I'm not seeing any trout at all. The fish I'm seeing, I'm pretty sure, are mostly creek chubs.
fly rod is starting to get to me. So I'm gonna use my ultralight spinner for just a little bit before switching back to it. There we go. All right guys, just caught another fish. I'm not too sure what this is. Oh, I think it's a creek chub. See you later, buddy. I've caught quite a few creek chubs, but my target species still eludes me. There is one spot on this creek where I believe if I'm gonna catch a trout, it's gonna be there. So it's about, I think, half mile hike from where I'm at currently. So I'm gonna head straight there and hopefully catch a trout. I am finally coming up to the fishing spot. This is where I caught some really nice ones last time I was out here. Hopefully there are still some trout beneath this little spillway. I'm gonna sneak up with my fly rod and hopefully hook into one. Man, you guys, my rig is all messed up. It's getting dark. This is not good. I'm gonna try to use it as it is. There we go. All right. Well, I caught another fish. Unfortunately, it is a creek chub. My leader is all tangled. Instead of trying to salvage it, I'm gonna switch over to my ultralight spinner really quick to see if I can catch a trout because it's getting dark. All right, guys, here we go. And it's starting to rain. There we go, fish on. Oh my gosh, that's a big one. Please stay on. Holy cow, you guys. No way. It's a toad. Holy smokes. I cannot believe I just caught this. See you later, buddy. Yes, that fish was incredible, but I do not have time to celebrate right now because it is raining and all of my camera gear is getting soaked. I need to make a quick hike back to the truck before all of my stuff gets ruined. I am so far away from my truck. It's gonna be a miracle if my camera stuff isn't ruined by the time I get there. I finally made it back to the truck, but holy smokes, what an awesome day of fishing. Unfortunately, I did not complete my goal of catching my first wild trout on my fly rod, but I did catch a handful of nice fish, including a new personal buzz creek chub, and that last trout at the end that I caught on my ultralight was unbelievable. I had no idea fish that size were hiding in that creek, so I just feel lucky to have caught that fish, which is by far the biggest wild trout that I've ever caught. So I had a lot of fun today. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. I will catch you in the next one. Oh no, I just cast a whip into a tree.